Three, two, one, zero. Ignition. And I have dreamed about going to space my entire life. A dream come true for Cyan Proctor. I like to think that space has been in my DNA. The South Mountain Community College professor has always dreamed that her true calling was among the stars. Getting her chance, thanks in part to this video. You've got space, I've got space. A poem combining space with poetry. We all have space to inspire. That's why we dream of going higher and higher. Helping to book her ticket out of this world. So when I think about sitting here and what we're going to be doing with Inspiration4, I can't help but to think about my father's legacy. See, Cyan's love of space begins with her father, Edward Langley Proctor, who spent time working as a NASA contractor on the Apollo missions. And I grew up with all of this space memorabilia, such as Neil Armstrong's autograph to my father, thanking him for all his help for Apollo 11. Her entire life, Cyan dreamed of making it to space. She was a finalist for the astronaut selection process back in 2009, just falling short. I was more worried that this opportunity had slipped me by. But this time? Instead of that no call, I got the yes. And it's that life-changing yes moment. She's finally getting the chance to reach among the stars. It's setting in that this is real. It was supersonic. Something that I have wanted my entire life. Dragon nominal trajectory. The all-civilian crew is planning on trying to raise money for St. Jude during this trip, and they could be taking off as early as September. We're in Phoenix. Michael Doudna, 12 News.